Hello YouTube, Heather Tomberlin here. It is nighttime, so I kind of lied about when I'm gonna uh, um, when I'm gonna shoot these. Um, from now on, I'm just gonna shoot these videos whenever I have time. So anyway, I see a lot of um, what's in the bag segments on YouTube, so I thought I would do my own version. I got a cute little bag here. And I mentioned to you guys before, I have autism, ADD, and social anxiety. And these are ways, uh, this is a way of coping with my autism. I take this with me and I've got some little coping skills. So this is kind of a different kind of what's in the bag. First of all, I bring Julia. Hi. <laughs> From Sesame Street. She's got autism too. She's the only one in my family who knows what I go through. Uh, if you've never seen, uh, if you've never seen the video of Julia on Sesame Street, I highly recommend it. I'll try to remember to put it in the description box. If not, I'll put it, uh, if not, I'll put a link on the comment section. So, uh, so she can't fit in the bag, so I just carry her. So I'll show you what's in the bag now. I have... This cute little frog here. It's really soft. Uh, uh, a lot of people with autism love soft things, so having soft things around can really come in handy. Um, cute things can calm me down. It's just me. So I've also got uh, uh, I've also got a Christmas ornament I had when I was a kid. It's got blue. Uh, it's got blue from Blue's Clues and also shovel and pail. <laughs> I love talking like blue. Okay. <laughs> so inside here, I've got... My brother got me this for Christmas, a little sketchbook. Um, I like to draw pictures in here. And, well, I mean, that's what a sketchbook is for. And... I also got a lead pencil that a friend got me. Um, I'm actually out of lead, so I'm going to have to fill that back up. Okay. Um, I've also got a cute little bunny here named Snowflake for days I forget Julia. Um, what's this? Oh, I drew this for my brother on his graduation day and I forgot to give it back to him. I was going to keep it safe for him until after graduation, and I forgot to give it back. Oh, well. I'll give it back to him in a bit. Uh, I got a little stress ball here. <clears throat> it's really squishy. It's a little sticky, too, but I can handle it. Yeah, that, that really takes some pressure off. Love stress balls. In this compartment, I keep a set of earplugs because uh, uh, because of my sensory to my ears. So, so yeah, I have a set of earplugs. Uh, those are the things I keep in my bag. So, um, I hope that gives you some ideas. Um, if you have autism too, those are some, uh, those are a few ideas, like, um, of things that might help you. Maybe something completely different will help you. That's, that's okay. Every, uh, Everyone who has autism, it, it works for them in different ways. So, um, subscribe to my channel. If, if you take anything with you to keep you company, to help you with your autism, if you have it, uh, tell, me, uh, tell me in the comments what, uh, what keeps you company. So, I will see you next time. <laughs> she said, have a blessed day.